Hi, this is Kenneth Yu, the Puppet Master. And welcome to this special video presentation titled Upheaval, the new online marketing order. And in this short three minute video, I'm going to reveal to you the different insights that I have about online marketing uh, ever since we've been doing it in the trenches for the past year or so. And these lessons are lessons that will serve you well if you want to pursue your online marketing dream. So this is marketing today. As you can see to the right of the screen, there is a great battle raging on. This painting is the Battle of Alexander, which is this massive epic battle um, thousands of years ago. And almost in the online marketing space, this is what is happening as well. I mean, now we see the death of the one-man show, where previously, if you're a work-at-home mom, if you are a student, you can, you know, set up your PPC campaign, write a squeeze page, and, you know, submit an article to Easy Articles, and you have made some form of money. But the problem right now is because so many wannabe marketers are, are, are basically invading the scene, and that's why you, your a piece of the already minuscule pie is getting smaller and smaller. And especially when now jobs are, are you know hard to come by and times are tough, everyone's flocking online to, to, to do business. And as a result of that, you have a whole ton of one-man shows trying to compete for a small portion of the pie. And previously, you don't even need... Uh, you, you may not need finances to, to, to do anything. You probably need your sweat labor and you, know, you pay for a domain or something like that. But the problem right now is in this day and age, because there are a lot of mature marketers on the scene and they are doing stuff that requires some form of upfront cap capital, be it upfront capital in your PPC or banner advertising, be it upfront capital in in hiring a team of writers. I mean, one easy articles used to go a long way before. Now, it, one article is like a drip in the ocean because everyone's using writers to, to, to pump out content like crazy. So if you're only building backlinks, one backlink at a time, you're no way, you're not going to compete with anyone. You're not going to compete with me because, you know, I have a whole army of people doing, you know, my micro sites and everything. And... As a result, you need that capital. For us, we have to amass that capital somehow. You need to treat this like a business because without capital, your business is not able to start. In the same way, if you want an online marketing business, you need to treat it like a business. And you, and there's brutal competition in both SEO and PPC. The whole microsite concept and keyword optimized domain can only help you to a certain degree. But if you meet somebody who's a backlinking um, expert or he has a team of people working for you, you are going to lose. Online marketing isn't for the housewife, it isn't for the, the aspiring um, you know, one-man show anymore. That, those times are the things of the past. And I mean, look at your PPC spend. You know, I, I think uh, your CPCs, your cost per clicks have increased tenfold over the past uh, two to three years and that is because Google knows that 20% of the top spenders, that means people like Amazon, like eBay, contribute to 80% of the revenues, and that's where their entire uh, focus is shifting. And there's a short lifespan of tactics. You may have one tactic to fool Google and to fool the search engines, but the big issue right now is a lot of online marketers are desperate for money. I mean, it may seem shocking to you, but a lot of the so-called experts online are not even making a lick unless they do a product launch or something like that. And, you know, there's only a limited amount of stuff to do a product launch on because there's not that many new internet marketing tactics. So whatever new tactic that people use, uh, that these marketers use, they stupidly reveal it to the world in some big launch and short term, I make them, you know, their 100000 on a million dollar day and stuff like that. But what you get is a flood of competition where there wasn't any competition before. I mean, look at pay-per-view. It used to be viable, now it's not. And PPC before, it used to be viable, now it's not. 
banner advertising now, people are coming in. I mean, Google Image Ads, Content Network, they're all getting a very a big surge of competition. As a result, again, prices go up. You need to treat your business like a sandwich deli. And what I mean by that is, even a normal sandwich deli is really complex. Because first, you need to manage your stuff, you need to make sure your recipes are okay, you need to make sure inventory is in check, that you know people are going to the market to buy the food, you need to be able to do the marketing, you need to be able to do the operations. So even just one small sandwich deli in the corner of some random neighborhood somewhere has that degree of complexity. And now even with online marketing, there is that degree of complexity. You need to set up the processes. You need to be able to, 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 to assemble your team. You need to you know, you need to keep tabs on your suppliers. I mean, gone are the days where you know you work at home and you write your own blog posts and everything like that. I mean, that's still possible, but it's becoming less so. And the only way to approach this game is through a business owner's viewpoint. And if you have a business before, if you're used to you know, run a salon or a restaurant or something like that, then online marketing is for you. But if you're coming in with the expectancy that, hey, I'm one person with my sweat labor, I should be able to make some money, my answer to you is, I'm sorry, that is not going to happen. And it's best that either you leave, amass some capital, learn out how to actually run a business, and then proceed into online marketing. So these are the five different, I guess, different uh, ways or the different developments that have happened over the past year, uh, which I was in online marketing. I mean, even my model has shifted a lot to other things. So, I mean, I'll probably reveal to you more and more what those are as, uh, I mean, as the proof of concept and when the money rolls in more consistently and when, you know, we can ramp it up and everything. Everything is still in the preliminary stages, but we are shifting away from the old way of doing online marketing, the old way of doing uh, running an internet business. And so comments are welcome. What do you think of these five points? Which, which of these points do you think hit home with you? And, you know, despite me saying all this, or maybe because of me saying all this, I wonder how many of you still want to pursue your online marketing dream? And how many of you would, would be willing to go through that perspective shift or that paradigm shift and able to attain that? So comments are welcome and I'll, there will be more videos in the coming days. Uh, basically, uh, I would say unpacking each of these points. And this is my way of, of thanking you for being a subscriber and for sticking with me throughout uh, this crazy journey of ours. So this is Ken of You, the Puppet Master, signing off. And I'll see you in the next video that's coming real soon. Bye.